Hey guys, a uh, quick tutorial video here for Killing Floor. Um, I used to play Killing Floor a hell of a lot. Um, I've actually done a previous tutorial video on it. Um, and I recently just came back to it and I realized that the filters weren't really working. I was putting in certain filters and the servers I was getting back didn't, you know, didn't correspond with those filters. Um, so I did a little bit of looking around, found a solution, thought I'd uh, do a quick video showing you how to solve uh, solve that issue in case you're having it. So this is uh, this is with the with the uh, issue. So I'll go into multiplayer. I'll go into internet games, um, and I'll say I only want hell on earth servers. I can get rid of all the other filters. Uh, so basically, it should only be returning hell on earth servers. But you'll see it's returning every single type of difficulty. It's returning normal, it's returning beginner, it's returning hard, suicidal. You know, there's only one hell on earth that's actually come up with a with a fairly low ping. Um, and th this happens for no matter what filter you put in. It seems that it's, you know, it's ignoring it completely, which is obviously a frustration, um, especially if you want to play on a specific difficulty or you want to... Only, you don't want passworded servers to come up. You don't want you know full servers to come up because you can't join. You don't want empty servers to come up because you don't want to be playing by yourself, and so on and so forth. And um, so there is a quick fix to this. Uh, thankfully, uh, I found the answer on a Steam forum somewhere. But I thought I'd make the answer a bit more obvious to everyone else. Um, so I'm going to close down Killing Floor because the answer is not in Killing Floor. Um, so you want to go to your Steam folder. Um, th luckily for me, um, because I I often have to edit stuff in the Steam folder, I actually just created a sh a, sh eh, a desktop shortcut. Um, so I have a shortcut going to my Steam uh, directory. Um, so for me, it's in C drive, program files, um, Steam, Steam apps, common. Um, that's roughly the directory you want to go to. Obviously, you might have installed your games somewhere differently. So it will be wherever you've got your Steam installation. Um, and then go into Steam Apps and then Common, and then it should give you a list of all the Steam games you have uh, installed or not, basically all the Steam games you've bought. So we want to go into Killing Floor, um, and then we want to go to System, and then there's a load of files in here. What we want to do is scroll all the way down, um, not too far, and there should be a file called serverfilters.ini. Um, this is the file you want to open up. Um, now you'll see here there's there's a bunch of uh, information well I say a bunch there's some information um, and the cause for the issue is this line of code at the bottom where it says active equals false and this is actually means the server filters that we, we were trying to use uh, aren't working they're not turned on they're, they're set to false um, I have no idea what causes this I, I don't know why you'd ever want the filters of your game to be turned off um, they used to work for me before I stopped playing, just came back recently, and, and this is now set to false for some reason. Um, so, simple fix, set it to true. <laughs> um, if this is already set to true for you, and you're still having server issues, um, then this video is not going to help you, because uh, setting active to true for me worked just fine, and you'll see it working just fine now. Um, so just click file and save, um, you can double check. Click server filters again just to make sure it has properly saved for you. And you can close down out of this and then we can go back into Killing Floor. Wait for it to load up. Uh, wait for it to load up off center for some reason. Uh, come on, give me control. Let's, let's drag this back into uh, where we can actually see it. Um, so now I'll go to multiplayer. I'll go to internet games um, and I've got hell on earth and now when we hit refresh we should only get hell on earth servers after it queries the master server. See now you'll see that only hell on earth servers are being returned um, my difficulty is being properly uh, used um, so just for another thing we can click just to double prove it we'll click no empty servers we'll stop and then we'll go again, and now you'll see I'm only returning servers with, you know, people in them. So that is the quick fix of how to sort out your um, your filters not working. There was another fix uh, besides this, 
which spoke about Defense Alliance, which is one of the free mods you can get for Killing Floor, and having to go into that and setting a server filter to do something. Um, but that didn't make sense to me because I don't have Defense Alliance installed at all. So this one is specifically just for, you know, vanilla Killing Floor fix. Um, if you have any questions on, on this fix or on how to access any of the different uh, sections that I, I discussed in this video, just leave a comment below. Um, though if this fix worked for you and you can now get your filters working and you can now join the games you want to join, uh, leave a like on the video uh, and it lets me know that I've, I've managed to help people out. Um, so I hope, I hope that helps. Uh, I'll see you next time.